Hey guys, Nick Mahavich, Active Therapy. We get the question a lot of what is the core and how do I improve it? Core is a big, big uh, idea out there, a big word now that people are always wondering, how do I improve it, what do I do? If you improve your core, it's gonna obviously help with your back pain, it's gonna help with a lot of things you do throughout the day because you're gonna be able, you're gonna be stronger and more stable to do, you know, work, household, and even recreational activities. So, one thing, real easy to do is we just want to try to tighten up the core. So the core is the muscles that go right around your waist, right around your mid section here. That includes your stomach muscles, that includes your back muscles. Some people even include the hip muscles. What we want to do is we want to get those stronger, more stable, so you can do those things throughout the day. So the first thing is, is if you are a person that slouches, okay, or maybe you're a person that has too much arch in their back, all right, what we want to do is we want to find that neutral position where we don't have too much arch and we don't have too much of the opposite. So we want to find that neutral position. Just getting into that position, you're going to start engaging your core muscles. If you kind of tighten up your core muscles, okay, we want to be able to tighten them up, but we want to be able to talk and breathe at the same time. Right now, I'm tightening up my core muscles, but I'm still talking to you guys. The way I try to do it is I just try to push my stomach muscles into my hands, okay? If you're trying to push those stomach muscles into your hands instead of holding them up like this, you're not gonna be able to breathe or talk. So if you can push those stomach muscles out into your hands while doing different activities, that itself is gonna help you out quite a bit with your core. And it's gonna help you with activities throughout the day. I'm gonna show you probably the best core exercise that we give almost all of our patients here. It's really simple. I know you guys have heard of it. It's called a plank. So what I always have patients start with or people that are just learning and trying to get going with their core muscles is we do a half plank. We just do it on our knees and our elbows. So we're just gonna be on the knees and the elbows. You can see my back is nice and level and we're gonna try to hold that. Now you can hold that um, for even five to 10 seconds to start. If you feel like your core is a little weak or maybe you have a little back pain that you don't wanna aggravate, start up with that and build up, try to build up to 30 seconds. If you can hold that for 30 seconds, you are doing a great job. You can even do that two times for 30 seconds, even better. Once that gets easy and you're holding that for 30 seconds or more, then you can go to do the full plank where you're up on your toes and your elbows, okay? So you can lift up, you can see toes and elbows, my back is nice and level and straight. Again, same thing, if you do one or two of those a day, you'll be amazed at how much better your back's gonna feel, you're gonna be amazed at how much stronger your core is and maybe even develop, maybe even burn some of that uh, access uh, around the waist that nobody has and everybody, nobody wants and everybody has. So if you have questions about core strengthening or back pain that uh, may be affected from those weak core muscles, always reach out to us. Give us a call 402-932-2888. Thanks. We'll talk to you guys soon.